Hey, Mookie, Dave uh, has been saying for the better part of a week that uh, you guys are targeting tomorrow to be activated. Is that still the case? Yeah, yeah, I uh, feel pretty good and uh, you know, we'll be ready to go tomorrow. What's changed over the course of the week? He mentioned that you had a cortisone shot and it didn't really respond. How, is, how have things been able to get to this point where you're able to play tomorrow? Um, I guess, you know, maybe I think the cortisone shot just took a little longer, um, to kick in than expected. Um, you know, obviously the training staff has been doing a, a great job in, in getting me, uh, my body ready. Um, you know, so it's, uh, been, uh, definitely a team effort to, to get, uh, get ready for tomorrow. Mookie, uh, has there been any discussion about you playing the infield or is this strictly about play when you play, you'll be back out there in right field? Uh, I think uh, then there's definitely been some discussion, um, you know, just trying to limit the miles, um, you know, so, uh, you know, we'll kind of see uh, where Doc's head is at, uh, you know, for tomorrow. Last one for me. Um, it, it, I don't know if you've answered this before, but how did this hip issue come up? I, I know you've been dealing with it all season long. Was it on one player? Has it been a progression of things? Um, honestly, I don't know. I can't say it's been one play. I haven't done any, haven't fell or, or done anything um, out of the ordinary. So it's, it's really weird um, why it came, came about, um, but um, you know, it did. So you just gotta, uh, you know, play the, play the hands you're dealt. Thanks Mookie. Next question is from Kirsten Watson. Go ahead. Hey Mookie, in Colorado, you had shared with us that you felt that you were fine and you thought it was just going to take maybe a day or two to kind of get back. But at what point did you realize your hip was going to need a little bit more time? Um, you know, after that day or two, uh, and it, it didn't get any, it didn't get any better. Um, and so, um, you know, I'm, I'm kind of, uh, in tune with my body and, you know, I definitely missed that one. Um, so, uh, that's, that's the tough part is not really, uh, I don't really know why it's here or, or, or how to really get it to go away other than time. And, um, we don't have that. So, uh, we just have to kind of, uh, manage it and do everything we can to, to keep it at bay. And with this time that you did have, were you able to allow yourself to kind of help rehab some of the other things that you were dealing with as well, or any other pains that you might've had? Yeah, absolutely. Um, I think, uh, I think everything's good to go. I mean, just got to keep an eye on, on the hip and everything should be fine. And then from your perspective, what have you been seeing from your team, your teammates recently in this kind of these last few games stretch? Um, I think we, you know, we've, uh, put ourselves in some good spots to win games, um, but we haven't had the big hit to that that leads to other hits. Um, we haven't put up zeros um, when it's time to put up zeros. And um, but you know it's just part of the season. You know it's not like we're not out there trying. So um, you know it is what it is, and we just gotta uh, get back to 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 getting that hit or that zero uh, for for us to get over the curve. Thanks, Mookie. Next question is from Fabiana. Hey, Mookie, I know you sort of touched on it a minute ago, but, I mean, you've been pretty hesitant to go on the IL through some of these other minor issues, but how much do you feel like just having 10 days to, like, sit down and shut down for a little bit after the All-Star break, too, uh, can just sort of help you the last couple months of the year? Um, I mean, any break is, it's you know, good. any type of mental break is, is um, you know, good, especially in this long, long season. Um, definitely was a uh, bad timing. Um, I started to feel a little better and uh, putting some good swings on some pitches, but I um, you know, it is what it is. Um, you know, just kind of, uh, like I said, play the card and just that you're down. And then you've been on the other side of like a big superstar, just being added to this team. I mean, what is that experience like? And what do you think it sort of shows about this organization that they keep going out and getting guys like yourself, Trey Turner, Max Scherzer? Um, you know, it's, you know, those are, those are guys, you know, we get excited to, to have them perform, but, um, you know, I think uh, we just welcome them in and, and let them continue to play and, and do do what they always do. And, um, you know, uh, it just shows that uh, it also just shows that uh, the front office is, is here. We want to win now, and we want we want to win every year. And so, um, you know, just being a part of a, a organization just like this um, is the you know the reason why I'm here. Next question is from Bill Poindexter. Yeah, Mookie. Yeah, 
likes questions you might be sure on it. Go ahead. <laughs> uh, Plunk must have a bad connection there. Um, how do you feel about the possibility of uh, having you and Trey Turner at the top of the lineup? Uh, I mean, you know, it'd be pretty cool. I mean, uh, we'll, we'll see. Uh, we should see here real soon. I mean, you know, I'm definitely excited that, that these guys are, are joining the team to help us uh, win another ring. So, um, but I'm not really thinking about you know, me, Trey, or whoever at the top of the lineup. I'm just thinking about going out and winning ball games. Andrew mentioned the speed sort of component that he brings. How can that sort of change the dynamic of the lineup a little bit? Um, I think, you know, throughout the game, we don't have to necessarily string together two, three, four hits to score runs. Um, you know, we can steal a base and move a guy and then have a, a sack fly. Um, you know, we don't have to have a hit to necessarily score a run um, with, with guys like him. And so um, that he definitely uh, makes them, you know, have to be quicker to the plate, which in turn may get some guys a couple more pitches to hit. And so I think it just adds adds to the the all around game of, uh, of baseball for sure. Thanks. Got time for one more. Go ahead, Bill. Sorry about that, Mookie. Try again. Have you ever had a year like this with uh, where the nagging injury just kind of piled on each other? No, uh, this is the first time. Um, you know, it's, I don't have. Uh, I I wish it would have came from like I ran into the wall or something, not just uh, from out of nowhere. Um, you know, that it would have made a little more sense. Um, but you know, like it, it, it is what it is. You just got to deal with it. Um, and so hopefully. Uh, like I said, we've, we've done a, a good job. The, the training staff has done a, a great job in, in helping me get to where I'm at now, and hopefully we can just uh, kind of keep it at bay. As great an athlete as you are, you weren't blessed with Aaron Judge's size. Do you think uh, all these things take an edge away from you more so because of uh, your, your stature? I don't think so. Um, yeah, <laughs> I, yeah I, I, I don't think so at all. I like that answer. Thanks. Thanks, man. Thanks, everybody.